Welcome to the project demonstration of Arduino based car speed detection along with uh, alerting system by using RFID and IR sensors are used to detect the vehicle speed and RFID data is used to detect the vehicle number plates. So based on the number plate detection the system will capture the vehicle speed by capturing the time to pass the vehicle from these two sensors. So when the vehicle passes from the sensor 1 it will capture the time. So as we have placed the sensors around uh, 10 centimeters of distance. So as we know the distance and we will get the time after the sensor 2 will get the input from the vehicle presence. So the time and the distance from there we are going to calculate the vehicle speed. So if the speed was above 30 km per hour, so for demonstration we kept the limit as 30 km per hour. Then the system will send the message alert to the registered phone number. So by say attaching the vehicle number to that along with the speed alert. So here we are using uh, GSM modem to send the message alerts. So EM18 RFID reader to uh, get the vehicle number plate recognition and IR sensors to find the vehicle presence. <coughs> the, all these inputs and output modules are interfaced to the Arduino you know. So right, so like this we are going to receive the messages whenever the vehicle crosses the threshold value. So like this uh, we will get the 30, uh, 4, 30 kilometers per hour is a limit in our project. So now coming to the interfacing connections. So we have interfaced these two IR sensors at Arduino you know at the pin number 6 and 7 and this LCD display interface gets A0 to A5 and RFID reader module interface at the pin number 10 and GSM modem at 8 and 9. So these are the input and output connections. So coming to the IR sensor. So this IR sensor has the two LEDs, IR LEDs, in that the white color is a transmitter, black color is the receiver. So whenever any white color object or any object presents in front of this, the surface of the object reflects the IR rays and the receiver will receive the reflected rays. Then the controller will get the pulse input from the receiver module. So whenever you get the pulse input as indication of there is a object presence in front of this IR sensor. And coming to the RFID reader, when we place the RFID tag in the region of RFID reader, so this tag consists of copper coils and one small microchip. So when we place that, this copper coil will induce the power and provide us the voltage to the chip and the chip will transmit the a unique ID. So that will be given as input to our UNO board. So based on the speed from the IR sensor, the capture number will be sent uh, along with the message alerts and also audible alerts. So the whole system getting power supply from this 5 volts adapter. So this uh, 5 volts are distributed along with this breadboard. So from there we are going to distribute in the 5 volts power supply to the input and output modules. The inputs are RFID, IR sensors and output LCD, GSM modem and buzzer. So let us see the demonstration. Before on the kits we need to insert a micro SIM card here. So in this manner we need to insert check twice before inserting that push to lock and push to unlock the notch should be upper side so better to use a HL uh, the particular sim card should have the sms balance or main balance so push to lock push to unlock right so now it is locked after that on the power supply so we need to hold the you know board till the GSM modem got the signal because after getting the signal only we can get the SMS alerts so for, for, for that purpose we can see there is a light indication over here it's blinking fast now once the GSM modem get the signal the blinking rate comes down to slow right now it is slow blinking rate so then you can make a call to the SIM card for double confirmation so now reset the Arduino you know so welcome message will be displayed on the LCD screen so when we show the RFID tag, there is a light indication on the RFID reader, we can see that it will blink. So it blinks and then check the speed. Right. Also we can see the vehicle count also. And the number plate will be displayed the, at the end. So it crosses 32 km per hour. So as we can see it is sending the message alerts. So we will receive the message in your mobile phone. So, right. so we got this message alert the vehicle number and involve the speed violation the speed is 32.36 km hour so this is a message alert we will get from the system okay